I'm gonna be sharing with you the three basic makeup products for beginners. Ladies, let's get this beauty started. I get a lot of questions about simplifying makeup routines and what are the most important products? What are the products that, you know, are kind of like my go-tos if I just wanted to be very simple or, you know, I'm just starting off with makeup. What, what do I need? What are the most powerful products that I can put in my makeup bag? And I picked out three products, ladies, that if you're wanting to make an impact, but you don't want to do a lot of steps, this is what I would suggest for you. First and foremost, I would suggest a mascara because I feel like it opens up the eyes. So I have, and I've been using in my makeup tutorials, my um, beautiful creamy uh, mascara. Now, you know, I was hooked on the Chanel for a long time, like four, three or four years. And I have been looking ever since for a, a, a certain formulation for my company. And I finally found it, I just launched this like two weeks ago. And I wanted a certain one. So I've been very particular about creamy formulations. It has to be creamy. It can't be too thick. It can't be too dry. This is such a beautiful formulation. And the wand is curved and it has all these little teeth on both sides. That's what's really important because it's not on just one side. It's not, it's not, it's not a round wand where it can get too all over the eye. It's hard to maneuver. This is very flat and skinny. And so you can get to the base of the lashes and really work them up and separate them at the same time. So it's really like a two in one. Then I'll turn it to the flat side and I'll coat the lashes again. So this is going to give a very big impact for you, for beginners that really want to have products that are going to make enhance their beauty, make their beauty shine, but not be wearing a lot of a lot of makeup. So that's the first and foremost is mascara. If you did nothing else, mascara is going to make you look more awake. It's going to make you look more alive and it's going to be simple to do. And it's cost effective because you're going to keep this for three months. So that's also a, a something to think about too. My second product that I feel for beginners that's going to make an impact on your beauty, enhance your beauty, is a powerful lip. Now, color is what we want. If you want to just simplify and get down to bare bones, you're gonna want to have some color on your lip. You don't want something that's nude. You know that you're not wearing a lot of makeup. So we have mascara on, and now we're gonna do a beautiful lip. I have chosen today, um, this is a new lipstick for my line called On A Mission. I love it. Just a little bit of gloss. It's moisturizing. It gives me a pretty pink color to my lip. It makes me look alive. It's not a powerful red. It's not too nude. It's just a really, really pretty color. So you want to add color. You want to add color. And this is another tip, ladies. This is what I love to do. And I think a lot of us forget that we can do this. You can use this on your cheeks for a little bit of a cream blush. So you get a two in one. So you have your lipstick that you have beautiful lips. Then you can just swatch. You know what? I'm going to do it. I don't even have a mirror here. Actually, I'll bring out my mirror because I want to make sure that I'm on my cheeks, right? So you can just smile, put a little bit like this on your cheeks. I did this in Hillary's video when I, I think I used FBS on her cheeks. I'm going to be using a lipstick. This is FBS and I'm using a lipstick on her cheeks and you can do that. So I want to keep everything creamy and um, just dewy. So I'm going to just pop her cheeks with a little bit of color. I want it to look ultra natural. So I'm just putting it on. You'll know how much to do for yourself. And then we're going to just work it in. So she gets that color. You still see the skin through it. It's so beautiful. And just work it back. You can do bronzer if you want to also. Just use a darker shade of lipstick if you have that. But I just thought that it would just really just make her skin come alive. Just doing and keeping that dewy, kind of just very young, fresh look to the skin. And you just work it into your cheeks, spread it out. This could look a little much because I already have blush on, but I want you to see where I would apply it and how little you need. Just use it, work it into the skin, and then you have a little bit of a beautiful blush. Yes, it's a little much. I know everybody's gonna say, whoa, you have too much blush on. Well, guess what? I just layered <laughs> blush on blush. But that's a really great tip. So you can have it as a lip and a cheek. So you have two products in one. That's such a great thing for beginners, or this actually goes for anyone. And my third 
product that I think is so important is evening out your skin tone. Now you have a lot of options with this. You can use a tinted moisturizer like Chantecaille that I've been using a lot called Just Skin. Great moisturizing for more mature skins. I use it, I have combination skin, I love it. It gives me a beautiful flawless finish. I can just put it on, it doesn't take a lot of time, but it makes a big impact. You could just take a concealer and just spot treat your face also if you wanted to. So you don't have to, if you don't wanna wear a tinted moisturizer, say you already wear a sunscreen, you can do that too. Spot treat your face. It doesn't mean you have to wear a foundation or a tinted moisturizer, whatever you feel comfortable with. But those are my three basic products for beginners. A mascara, open up the eyes, make you look alive, make you look awake. Lip, make a powerful lip, a pink, a rosy color, a red, whatever is your, whatever you fancy, you can really bring your face alive with a beautiful lip color. And then you can also use it on the cheeks. Just remember what color family you're in when you, when you wanna transfer it to your cheeks. And then even out your skin tone. You want a beautiful canvas, you don't need a lot of makeup, you can spot treat with a concealer. Those are my three products that are a must have for beginners. And until my next video, ladies, I'll see you later.